Welcome to the dungeon. Let's play dance. Hi guys, um, I call this game the Checkout Builder. Um, it's a really simple game and it's to help beginners learn how to switch and hit combination finishes and rather than just aim at each double relentlessly practicing um, you start from 41, you have three darts, you take it out in three and move up to 42, take that out in three, up to 43 and you just keep on going, keep on going. It's three dart finishes um, and teaches you a little bit of board management, consistency and also contingency planning. If you don't hit the big number you're aiming for early, what are your options? Where do you go? How do you set up your favourite double? This is how we play. So we start off nice and simple, 41 checkout with 3 darts in hand. I always go for the 9 and then aim at the double 16. If I come inside the double 16, I get a shot at double 8. So that moves me on to 42. I like to use the 10s and the 6s area here which should guarantee me a shot at a useful double. In this instance, leaving double 16 again to check out 42. For 43, I normally like to go for a single three and double tops. Here you can see I go slightly wrong into the double one and then switch straight down to the double 19. This is what I was talking about, about having a contingency plan when you miss the shot you're going for. If you watch again here, the speed in which I realize my error and I'm able to switch means that I maintain my rhythm all the way through the shot. We'll watch one more time to see the time it takes me between darts number two that went into the double one to switch down to the double 19s. You'll see there we freeze it just as I notice the error and then I'm able to keep my rhythm as I know exactly where I need to go and I hit the double 19 in less than two seconds. Moving on up the ladder a little bit, we'll go to number 46 so you can see again using the 10 and 6 area to guarantee a shot at a useful double. Skipping forward again a bit, we'll go through some contingency planning. Here, shooting for 69, I hit a 3 instead of a 19 with my first dart. Knowing where my switch is for 16 and bull, even though I didn't hit it, does mean that my opponent knows that I know which way to go. So a quick review of what you'll get from the checkout builder exercise. You'll get to learn your checkout routines know which routes you need to go in order to leave your favourite doubles. Again with the board management you know your way around the board moving from number to number to hit your big double. And finally contingency planning. You know if you miss that big number which way you need to go to make sure that you're guaranteeing yourself as many darts as possible at your favourite doubles. Thank you for watching this video on CV Darts. Remember to like, subscribe and leave a comment. You can also follow us at CV Darts on Twitter.